Hi, this is Bethany Copeland. I'm going to very quickly walk you through my online resources. If you are starting at the Perry High website, which most people can find, phs.hcbe.net, go to Welcome, go to Faculty and Staff. Once that loads, you will be looking for my name, Bethany Copeland, and this is alphabetical order. This little clickable arrow will open a new tab. This is my school page. Um, the main thing you are looking for here, you have a link to email me and email is the best way to reach out. Um, there's other information here, but my main thing for you to look for here, find the glitter. That is my teacher website. Okay. It is separate from the Perry High website. Um, <clears throat> for those of you taking dual enrollment economics, sit tight. I will get to that in a second. If you're taking U.S. history, that is what you will click on. Okay, first you have some resources on this like starting page. Quizlet is a great resource for fi figuring out um, whether you have a good grasp of just knowing information. Quizalizes multiple choice questions as a game. Um, I highly recommend you try both of these to see which one you prefer. Um, if you're not going to use Quizlet, that's fine if Quizalize works better for you. Um, there may not always be show me video lessons, but there will be video lessons from some platform. OK, so watch this space for video lessons. If you're looking for study guides, <clears throat> you will click there. You will have to know which unit you're looking for. Right now we're on unit one. Here is what you would find. This is the unit one study guide. This is the questions that I check about once a week. Um, this will give you a PDF of the questions if you lose yours or don't have yours with you. Um, this is the presentation. The PDF version is literally what I gave you a copy of. The Sway is an online version where all the links are live. Okay. Essentially the same thing. Okay. Um, this will take you straight to the Unit 1 Quizlet. And there's one of these for every unit. So if you lose your study guide or whatever, that should help you find what you need. So if you're taking U.S. history, that should be a general overview of what you need. If you are taking dual enrollment economics, you need a little bit more information. For you, I also have Quizlet. I also have Quizalize. Um, all of our online work will be through Blackboard. So here's the link to log into Blackboard. Um, there's also a link to show me video lessons. Even if I don't use show me, I will be using online videos. Um, so just watch this space. If you have questions about dual enrollment, there is a link straight to Central Georgia Tech. And then there are two specific resources I want to make sure to show you. OK, if you click on resources by textbook chapter, OK, you have all 16 chapters. And then what you will find on each chapter page, you will find a link to the presentation. There's the online version and the PDF. You'll find links to the digital textbook. That's online. Then you'll find the PDF. That's what I gave you a copy of. And then you'll find the chapter questions that are due. Um, this week's are due on Friday. OK, and then you have a link to the chapter one Quizlet folder. There's multiple Quizlets for some of these chapters and you have you will have this available for every chapter. The last thing I want to show you, this is probably the most important thing. If you are absent, um, if you click on the daily calendar, there is a clickable calendar that tells you specifically what we did um, and will either give you links to that, those assignments, or it will give you something that covers the same content. Okay. I may not always be 100% caught up on this, but I will do my very best. Um, Please use these resources. They are highly useful to help you stay caught up on your classwork. And if you have any questions, don't hesitate to email me. My email address is Bethany Copeland, uh, Bethany.copeland at hcbe.net.